It's a tough sport where there's absolutely no hiding. It's like Mario Kart's on ice when you're dragging yourself uphill with your arms. You have to train and train and train. It's brutal. It, it's really brutal, but I, but I enjoy it. You know, your heart rate's 180, 190 plus, and then having to bring that straight back down into the range to be accurate and to, um, to shoot is a real skill. If you are really good trained, it's easier to shoot. You are not <laughs> like this, like, like a dog. <laughs> One of the most important things for the athletes once they're slugging it out on the course is to know that it's being appreciated, not only by the fans, but also family. I love your town better Olympics. Hi, this is Rick Gretsch. I'm Kendall Gretsch's father. What's it been like as, as a dad to kind of go through this with her? Well, look, we uh, Kendall just picked up the sport a short time ago, and she works full time. So we were hoping she'd get any medals. And the fact she got a gold was just unbelievable. I work at a computer software company. Luckily I was able to get four months off so I could train full time this winter. I have a lot of family that made the trip out and a couple of friends and so it's really been awesome to have them here. I think it's fair to say the fans are loving it here today. Korea! I think it's really, really important that they get to see the sports like Paralympics because they can learn how to overcome different things in life. It's a nice change every four years to have a really big crowd to cheer on everybody, so it's a nice atmosphere, I enjoy it very much. We feel very important if there are so many people over here. I hope this game inspires up and coming athletes to take up the sport because it is, it is quite a mental and physical challenge and it's a wonderful way to travel as well as uh, push one's body and mind to the limits. The toughest Paralympic sport? It is the toughest Paralympic sport. Mark my words. I'd have to do them all to say it's the toughest, but I, I definitely think it's up there.